Gulfstream 4 covers macroeconomic policy and macroeconomic policy modeling. So most things that relate to macroeconomic policy, macrofiscal policy and research would be covered in there. One of the things that I think will be an interesting innovation in this iteration of SA Tide is some cross-cutting work that might work even beyond the core priorities of Workstream 4, but are really important for how we think about economic policy more generally and sort of some synergies across different disciplines of, econ of economics. So macroeconomic policy, microeconomic policy, econometrics, and how these things sort of work together. I think what we are specifically looking at are, are three things. The first is the generation of new knowledge in these particular f fields. So South Africa is faced by a number of issues. As a country, we have government debt problems, uh, public debt problems, and we have uh, a number of challenges from overseas spilling over into South Africa, you know, in, in countries like the US and UK, currently suffering from higher inflation, and the questions are whether that will spill over into South Africa. There's also questions about tax buoyancy, for instance, and, you know, if, so if income in the country goes up or down, what effect does that have on the uh, collection of revenue by the uh, government? So these are sort of the, the questions we need to look at and uh, really expand on that frontier, that knowledge frontier. The second aspect that we really want to look at is the creation of capacity, modeling capacity specifically. And then thirdly, we want to ensure proper communication and engagement with the uh, policy environment. So very often academics do a lot of work, but that does not necessarily spill over into the policy realm. And we want to improve that flow of information. Fundamentally, we hope to achieve, I think, the core idea of the SA Tide program, and that's creating this interface between very good evidence-based quality research and policy formulation and ensuring that these two things speak together in a way that's policy relevant. And I think what the, this work stream will be doing is ensuring that we're answering that question from a macro fiscal perspective or a macro policy perspective, but also doing it in a way that builds lasting capacity in institutions, which I think is critically important. <laughs>